So let's give you some big bag energy and let's take you through a selection of big bags and oversized bags that you can consider adding to your luxury collection. And at number one, we have the Chanel 22 bag in the medium size, specifically in the fabric options with prices starting at upwards of £4,280 and dimensions of 38 by 42 by 8 centimetres. The Chanel 22 bag begins a new chapter in the handbag history of the Chanel fashion house. The Chanel 22 bag was debuted in Chanel's Spring Summer 2020 Ready to Wear show under creative director Virginie Veillard. The number 22 has special significance within the Chanel lexicon and within Coco Chanel's love for numerology. For one, it is now the name of the latest Chanel bag referring to the year of its creation, just like the Chanel 19 released in 2019. The number 22 and the Chanel 22 bag also pays homage to the Chanel number no. 22 perfume, which was launched in 1922, a hundred years ago. Chanel's second perfume after its iconic Chanel number no. 5. The Chanel 22 bag is very different from the classic Chanel bag designs that have clean lines and a more feminine appeal. The Chanel 22 bag has a younger, fresher and more casual appeal than the more traditional Chanel bags. The Chanel 22 bag exudes a laid back appeal, but it is still an elegant piece that blends simplicity and comfortability with sophistication and practicality. Gabrielle Chanel was all about practicality and this bag exudes that. The Chanel 22 bag is a hobo style bag that offers a slouchy, relaxed silhouette, a departure from the structured silhouettes of the classic flat bags. And it also brings out Virginie Veillard's personal punk aesthetic to a T, oozing her subtle rock and roll edge to classic French style. The Chanel 22 bag is a lightweight functional bag made of supple calfskin leather in a semi-glossy or shiny finish. The Chanel 22 bag is also offered in different fabrics and textiles like tweed, quilted velvet and more. The Chanel 22 bag is a modern interpretation remaining consistent with Gabrielle Coco Chanel's desire and ethos of freedom of movement, femininity and practicality that inspired her to create her own carry-all in the 1920s. The Chanel 22 bag is a good bag for daily life, a perfect bag to fit all your daily essentials whether you're going to work or the gym. It can also be flattened and folded to use as an extra bag. The Chanel 22 bag features a magnetic button closure mechanism and drawstring, which gives it a sporty utility feel. The bag opens up to a fabric lined interior, one main compartment, a zippered pocket, and an accompanying removable pouch held in place by a snap hook. The Chanel 22 bag is also available in a few sizes, including a small, medium, large, and also comes in a backpack version. The Chanel 22 bag is also offered in a range of colours, including navy blue, purple, white and black. Although the shape of the overall style is different from the more traditional bags, the Chanel 22 bag still features many Chanel house coats, like the quilted leather, be it with a larger emphasis, and the classic metal chain strap interlaced with leather, allowing you to carry the bag over the shoulder. The Chanel 22 bag also features a few elements of hardware, in the signature Chanel lettering logo metal hardware emblazoned across the front of the bag. Finally, the Chanel 22 is adorned with a Chanel Paris medallion with the openwork double C as a charm hanging from the strap. The Chanel 22 bag is a striking yet playful tote bag, an offering from Chanel focusing on the needs of the working woman. The Chanel 22 bag is essentially a casual toss everything in bag, throw it over your shoulder and go bag. The Chanel 22 bag showcases Virginie Veillard's savoir-faire, combining simplicity and comfort in the most functional way, but still grounded by a distinctive cool and casual mode of elegance. And at number two, we have the Louis Vuitton Artsy bag in the MM size, with prices starting at upwards of £1,790 and dimensions of 41cm by 32cm by 22cm. The Louis Vuitton Artsy bag was introduced in Louis Vuitton's Spring Summer 2010 collection and came out with a bang. The Louis Vuitton Artsy bag is a striking balance of sophistication and modern elegance oozing a bohemian chic style. The Louis Vuitton artsy bag channels a free and care spirit, a perfect example of modern meets traditional. The Louis Vuitton artsy is an open top bag with a unique hobo appeal and a unique slouchy silhouette. The Louis Vuitton artsy bag also features a recently updated Bachetta leather single braided top handle detailing. 
that makes the bag look even more beautiful and more comfortable as it sits atop your shoulder. And the braided handle also helps the bag to retain its shape. The Louis Vuitton Artsy bag is also a very spacious bag that holds its shape. Its structural complexity adds to the wide structure of the simplistic exterior with a large base and it has folds on the sides that results in pleats that form a soft triangular shape. The strong base is reinforced with stitching and the Louis Vuitton Artsy bag tapers as it reaches the top. The Louis Vuitton Artsy bag was originally offered in the monogram canvas and is now offered in a few variations including the monogram Empriant leather. With the Louis Vuitton Empriant leather being the ultimate symbol of luxury due to its understated monochromatic look. And it also comes in a few shades like noir, taupe, marine and more. The Louis Vuitton Artsy bag is a functional and versatile bag currently only available in the MM size but has previously been offered in the GM size. The Louis Vuitton Artsy bag opens up to a textile lined interior with one main compartment, six patch pockets and a zipper pocket and is also adorned with elements of gold metal hardware including the D-rings, the studded bottom feet and the golden bag charm that hangs off the sides. The Louis Vuitton Artsy bag is definitely one of the more expensive and glamorous of Louis Vuitton's big bags and tote bags. It is a well designed bag to last a lifetime. The Louis Vuitton Artsy is a lovely addition that will elevate your luxury collection design. And at number 3 we have the Saint Laurent Rive Gouche bag. With prices starting at upwards of £1,350 and dimensions of 48cm by 36cm by 16cm. The Saint Laurent Rive Gouche tote bag is a semi-structured boxy tote that can actually fold completely flat. A workhorse bag good as a travelling bag and can be used for a variety of purposes from a beach bag to a weekender bag to an everyday bag. The Saint Laurent Rive Gouche is an open top lightweight bag made of linen with leather trim tubular handles and features a button closure and extendable side buttons giving the bag a lovely touch of luxury. The Saint Laurent Rive Gouche opens up to an unlined interior with one compartment and one zipper pocket and also comes with a zipper pouch inside. The Saint Laurent Rive Gouche features elements of gold and silver hardware with the logo stamped on the snap buttons and engraved on the zipper of the interior pocket. In the name of the Saint Laurent Rive Gouche tote bag, Rive Gouche translates to left bank in French. And the bag is also named after Saint Laurent's 1966 Rive Gouche ready to wear line. Inspired by the bohemian lifestyle and style worn by the Paris district's residents on Paris's left bank, on the bank of the Seine where Paris lies. He aimed to translate their look from streetwear to catwalk. Encouraged by his left bank muse, Lulu de la Falaise and Betty Catru. The Rive Gouche name is also inspired by the first boutique he opened on the left bank. The boutique opened in Paris's 6E arrondissement along the southern bank of the CN, La Rive Gouche. This move was monumental and pioneered a new wave of fashion. The Saint Laurent Rive Gouche is a timeless, clean and minimalistic bag that only comes in one size and is in actual fact a unisex bag that is displayed in both the women and men section. The bag is available in a natural cotton canvas as well as the all black canvas. The Saint Laurent Rive Gouche is also emblazoned with the Rive Gouche lettering across the front of the bag with a smaller script of the Saint Laurent written beneath it. The Saint Laurent Rive Gouche tote bag is the ultimate work bag that is inspired by the heritage of the iconic French fashion house, featuring the brand's original name. The neutral tote cites Saint Laurent's storied history. The Saint Laurent Rive Gouche is a simplistic, minimalistic, lightweight, lovely bag that you can consider adding to your luxury collection. And at number four, we have the Goyard Saint Louis tote bag in the GM size with prices starting at upwards of £1,280 and dimensions of 40cm by 34cm by 20cm. The Goya Saint Louis tote bag is the most ubiquitous and popular bag amongst Goya lovers and fashionistas around the world, especially used as a functional travel bag. Being one of the most popular and iconic bags from the Goya fashion house, this accessory is the epitome of innovation and tradition. Its name is a reference to King Louis IX of France, known as Saint Louis. First introduced in the 1930s, 
the Saint Louis tote bag is an unstructured tote bag with a basic silhouette crafted in an unlined supple goyardine canvas which has a very good resemblance to leather. The Saint Louis tote bag features a top flap that opens up to one big spacious and roomy interior with a matching detachable pochette attached to the bag with a snap button mechanism on one of the handles of the bag. The Goya Saint Louis tote bag is a reversible bag that can be carried either on the Goyardine canvas side or the linen and cotton woven side. It is best reversed on the Goyardine side for taking home wet things after a day at the beach, for example. The Goya Saint Louis tote bag was originally made to be a beach tote travel bag, the quintessential throw everything in tote, but not intended to carry heavy items. The Goya Saint Louis tote is an extremely lightweight tote that can also be folded completely flat, a simplistic tote with a lot of refined details, making it the perfect everyday companion. The tote features two chevroche calf skin handles, which become progressively thicker, fixed by five handmade stitches on each chap. The Saint Louis tote bag is available in 11 colour options to choose from. In the special colours category, which is any colour other than the black-brown combo, and the classic colours category, which is the black and the black tan colour, which also happens to be the most popular, Goya colour. The Goya Saint Louis tote bag is commonly offered in the PM and the GM, aside from the limited edition sizes in the Junior and the XXL. The GM size is mostly used for travelling. The simplistic Goya Saint Louis tote is a prized mainstay in Goya's handbag offering and is one of the most recognisable bags in the Goya handbag collection. For the traveller, busy woman or fashionista, the Goya Saint Louis tote is the perfect travel companion. And at number 5 we have the Hermes Garden Party Bag in the 39, with prices starting at upwards of over £3,500 and dimensions of 49cm by 36cm by 25cm. Debuted in 1964, the Hermes Garden Party Bag is a simple tote bag with a classic silhouette. A minimalistic bag with no obvious logos or visible branding indicating that the bag originates from Hermes. The Hermes Garden Party Bag's blank canvas can be personalised and accessorised with one of Hermes's colourful charms or twillies. The soft structure of the tote gives room to a generous interior. There is no top flap, only a clip closure, which means the capacity of the Hermes Garden Party Bag is not confined to its core dimensions. The Hermes Garden Party Bag features a single open compartment and an internal zip pocket secured by a single snap button. The simple design allows for easy access to its contents. The clou de sel snap fastening connecting the sides of the bag can be unclipped, allowing you to extend or expand the bag and opt for a wider base, extremely handy for times when you need to carry extra items, making it a great everyday travel bag. The Hermes Garden Party Bag comes in three sizes, the Garden Party 30, the Garden Party 36 and the Garden Party 39 size, less common and usually in a canvas. The sizes also correlate to a small, medium and large. The Garden Party 39 tote is more heavy duty and better for travel and packing. The small and medium size are more widely available than the 39 size. The Hermes Garden Party Bag is one of the most affordable Hermes handbags considering the exquisite finish and craftsmanship offered by the Hermes Fashion House. The Hermes Garden Party Bag has hit the mark on quality and functionality. It has a casual, relaxed vibe but is still structured and a very chic bag. The Hermes Garden Party Bag comes in two different styles, an all leather style or a canvas with a leather trim style. The canvas style has a canvas body with contrasting leather handles and trims. The leather commonly used for the all leather style is called Negonda leather. It is a soft supple leather with a matte finish. It is durable and water resistant, which is great because it will withstand a lot of wear and tear with frequent use. The full leather version of the bag is usually a single block colour, while the canvas version is available in both a single block colour or bicolour tones. Both the canvas and the all leather styles both have a canvas interior. The Hermes Garden Party bag is also available in many different colours and finishes so it's easy to find a style which appeals to your individual taste. Whether you're looking for a functional office bag or a casual shopper design, you'll have a lot of options to choose from in the Hermes Garden Party style. 
And at number 6, we have the Louis Vuitton Neverfull bag in the GM size, with prices starting at upwards of £1,450 and dimensions of 39cm by 32cm by 19cm. Debuted in 2007, the Louis Vuitton Neverfull is arguably one of the OG totes of tote bags. The name of the iconic Neverfull bag comes from the function it has to be never full. The Never Fall is an effortlessly practical tote. Originally launched as a seasonal bag, the Louis Vuitton Never Fall has since been re-released in a multitude of new materials and styles and has become a mainstay in the Louis Vuitton handbag collection. The Louis Vuitton Never Fall bag is crafted from waterproof and scratch resistant canvas, making it extremely durable, with some versions featuring a natural cowhide leather trim. The striped interior of this timeless tote bag is made with the canvas like the canvas of the original Louis Vuitton trunks of the past. The Louis Vuitton Never Fall bag is a slightly trapezoidal shaped shopper tote with drawstring like cinching straps on the sides of the bag, which can be drawn in giving the owner the flexibility to change the shape of the bag according to their preference and in order to make the Louis Vuitton Never Fall a compact, sophisticated city bag. The Louis Vuitton Never Fall is an open top tote that features two sturdy leather shoulder strap handles in addition to a piston-like clasp closure and opens up to one large open compartment and one zip interior pocket. The Louis Vuitton Never Fall also features an additional practical removable mini pocket pochette introduced in later versions post-2014. The Louis Vuitton Never Fall bag also comes with elements of gold-plated hardware on both the interior and exterior. The Louis Vuitton Never Fall bag is commonly offered in the brown checked Demier Ebene canvas, the white checked Demier Azur canvas, and the signature Louis Vuitton monogram canvas. Both the Demier Azur canvas and the monogram canvas come with a natural, untreated cowhide leather trim and handles, which develops a patina over time. Whilst the Demier Ebene canvas comes with a coated leather trim and handles, the Never Fall bag is also available in the Epi leather and the monogram Ompriant. Since 2014, the Neverfall's interior lining has been offered in a selection of bright shades, lending a pop of vivid colour and twist to the timeless Neverfall bag. The Neverfall in the Epi leather offering comes in a wide array of vibrant exterior colours. The Louis Vuitton Neverfall bag comes in three different sizes, the PM, the Petite model, small model, the MM, the Moyenne model, medium model, and the GM, the Grand model, large model which fits everything and the kitchen sink. The GM size is said to even carry up to 200 pounds. With a vast interior that seems impossible to fill, the Louis Vuitton Neverfall is definitely an ideal hand luggage option too. An ideal bag for the office to the beach, holding all your essentials from day to night. Not to be fooled by its lightness, the delicate looking cowhide handles have been reinforced with double stitching and thick overstitched chaps. The Louis Vuitton Neverfall tote is an iconic, functional, practical, durable, but most importantly, stylish tote. And at number seven, we have the Mulberry Bayswater Tote Bag, with prices starting at upwards of £750 and dimensions of 46cm by 28cm by 13cm. The Mulberry Bayswater Tote is another lovely tote, simple, spacious tote bag, big enough to fit in all your everyday essentials and cater to all your needs. The Mulberry Bayswater features two leather top handles so you can carry it over your shoulders or in your hand. The Mulberry Bayswater toad is a softly structured toad crafted from classic grain richly pebbled leather, available in a multitude of colours and deeply rich hues. The open top tote bag opens up to one internal compartment and a luxuriously contrasted soft suede like lining. The classic style features the signature iconic Mulberries postman gold tone twist lock closure fastening. The Mulberry Bayswater also has a removable zip pocket ideal for storing your most valuable items. The bag also features a discreet foil embossed Mulberry logo. The Mulberry Bayswater shopper tote is a quality tote crafted of materials known to stand the test of time. The perfect and trusted casual bag for everyday wear. The Bayswater tote from Mulberry is an eternal, practical tote, one to consider for your investment collection 